Howdy, I'm Mikey Diaz. Earlier this week, the King of Swaziland, the country's last absolute monarch, has officially changed his country's name to the Kingdom of Iswanti on the 50th anniversary of their independence. Congrats! In other news, Juniors and seniors at NHS with driver's license have the opportunity to purchase parking passes from the senior class. These parking passes permit a student to park in the main school lot, as opposed to using the stadium parking lot, which is much farther away. This year, however, you may have heard some threats that cars parked in the main lot without a proper pass would be towed. How are NHS students handling the situation? Where do you park when you get to school? I park in the stadium parking lot. I drive to school and I park in the lot right there. I drive to school and I also park in the parking lot. Same with me. Have you purchased a parking pass? No. I do not have a parking pass. No. No. How do you feel about the current parking policies at NHS? I think that they're too expensive. I think they're unfair. I don't think that you should have to pay to park at your own school, especially since this is a public school. A lot of people like will either get cars or licenses like partway into the year um, and I feel like parking passes are only advertised to be bought at the beginning of the year. I feel like there, there's enough parking spots for everybody that we shouldn't have to pay for them considering it's not like we're taking somebody who like rightfully bought it because like they're gonna have a space to park no matter what. I think it makes sense like money wise but I think like towing people is a bit intense. Especially yeah. since you're towing students like why would you tow a student's car? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Although some students have expressed disapproval over the parking fees at NHS, they are relatively low compared to other schools in Western Mass. Longmeadow High School charges $175 and Gateway charges $220. I spoke with Anna Conley, president of the senior class, to learn more about the high school's parking pass policies. Students purchase parking passes within the first couple weeks of school. Um, they're sold by the senior class in front of the office. Um, they're sold for two weeks and the first week is sold to just seniors um, and they're sold for $30. And then afterwards, the second week is opened up to everyone and those are sold for 35 Students used to have assigned spots because it was more organized, but this year we took it away because it was more difficult for the office when someone would park in the wrong spot and then everybody would shift around and then everybody would go to the office and complain. All of the money from selling parking passes goes to the senior class. I didn't come up with the price. Historically, parking passes have cost $30 for seniors and $35 for everyone else. The administration reserves the right to determine who is allowed to use the space. Prince Lombardi said that he can't say no when asked if the administration would actually tow students who illegally park but we'll use various steps to resolve any conflicts before calling a towing company. I'm Mikey Diaz. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next week on The Transcript.